Hi guys, DC Mafia back here, and today we have another X Men review. But not only that, it's a Marvel Lessons Apocalypse, my favourite style of Apocalypse. It's a box he comes in, pretty big. You can see the picture of him in the back. I left the inner tray out so you can see that. There's a mad cool picture of him in the back, which I'll be keeping. I'll be cutting that and keeping. It says X Men's Marvel's Apocalypse on the side. It's got a cool picture of him with his fist clinch. On the back, you get a lovely picture of him holding the skull. It says the yeah, Apocalypse launches an offense against. Mankind in the pursuit of the world where mutants rule, only the strong survive. Which is my favourite version of him. It's on the skull and all that. The box is pretty, pretty big. He comes with this massive cape, which is really good, lovely, and rubber. Lovely, lovely cape. Comes with another head. But just the fact, which look at the detail, the red eyes, and everything really, really nice detail on the map. I like that. Comes with a skull. I don't know why he comes with, with his skull, but he does. He comes with another f closed hand for his open hand, which is really cool in detail. Look at that, that's really cool. Now, I'll get on to the figure. There's, Let's look at the paintwork first, the paintwork on it, he's got veins in, in this thing, he's got a cool paintwork there, he's got these that lift up and down, he's got this, he's got the laughing face, look at that, which don't really like that face, I like the other face, but there you go, he's got a fist, which is well done, he's got these gauntlets here, you can see in the chest here, he's got all these things here, you come down there, he's got the red boots, he's got the red thing on him there, focus, camera he's got the with the red gauntlets i love the way the blue goes into this like darker silvery sort of blue here yeah, i love that red there um you can lift it forward and back as well but i've still got the thing on mine because if you don't keep the thing on that flops around stupidly and i know you can for movability and posing but for me it moves either way which is good so anyway as i said let's go on to the articulation now his head goes left his head will go right his head does go up and it does go down but for me because i kept this in one place i haven't like took the thing off yet i can't get me to go down but i'm not going to because i don't want this head on it either one but he comes with these cool solar things that go up here and up here it, it, that don't up, that and go all the way up and go all the way down. The solar pieces are not in the way at all, which is really good. And then you've got a cool elbow, but because the bicep's too big, that's how much range you can get pretty much. Um, you go down, he's got a swivel in the bicep, he's got a hand swivel, which is good. It's exactly the same on the other side. He's got an app prince where you can go down, like really down. Whoa which is good because he's a big boy so you can feed me look down right and then he can look all the way up oh. um his legs can go all the way down that way like he's doing a super kick <laughs> sort of thing you know and then he can got a little quince there which is for a big guy in bad he's got double leg is that double leg oh can't go kick his own ass but yep he's got that you can got that and uh, just the ankle and you got the wrist that goes up and down sadly it's not double one he stands approximately the same size as my ruler which is eight eight inches this guy is approximately eight inches tall dead on eight inches tall which is really good i'm gonna take the spare head off now so i'll show you how easy it is you just have to do a little camera a minute pop this head off look so you can see the head there and that will come off and you can take that off and put this back on and then you can swap it over for the my opinion the best head bang then that comes down and it sits lovely just like that look Roosting like that. That's how it looks with that head on. It's quite cool, actually. And then the cape, you've got a hole 
in the pig just there and there and the cape's got two holes in it and that cape just pegs in there and there so it pegs again in there you little bugger there you go and there's apocalypse look at that and then you lift his arm up obviously and the skull fits in his hand and be like holding up his skull in his hand like that be like looking at it like Ugh. or if you want obviously because he's really cool you can get like the head of an x-men but yeah that's it that's me over and done with if you like this this review i get subscribe check out my instagram for pictures of this guy and i shall see you again soon See you later, guys. Goodbye.